Hello and welcome to a very special football event. The 2008 season marked 150 years of Australian rules football. To celebrate this milestone, the AFL, in conjunction with Channel 7, commissioned a documentary that will take you further into our great game than ever before. Tonight you will see a revealing snapshot of what makes us love this game so much. You know, I love playing footy with you blokes. You'll be taken to places no fan has gone before as we follow the fortunes of 10 footy clubs throughout the 08 season. From the elite, you will have a front row seat to the inner sanctum of our top clubs. We can always carry them, we know we've got them. We can get them. We picked hard, ruthless competitors. Throughout the season and on grand final day. Boys, just come in for close. Come on. And we take you to the grassroots, the wide-eyed enthusiasm of our kids. To the clubs that keep a country town going. To the Middle East, where the game is bringing people together. You'll see and hear a champion boys. from a completely different view. You got study. Superstar. And meet the young hopefuls entering the big league. The journey starts and finishes with a dream. A dream shared by anyone who's played the game. You'll see the intimate moments of the players that reach the ultimate. An AFL Premiership. This is the essence of the game. Ah, boys! Come on! Something. Do! Don't think! Don't hope! Do! Not only you gotta play it moment by moment, contest by contest, do not accept what's going on! There are no tomorrows. This is the ultimate stage. Go out and enjoy it. Come on! In every game there is gonna be a crossroad. And when you get to that crossroads, you either step up or you step down. At least you can come off and say, I did this, or I shivered it, or I played on. At least I did something for the sake of the side. Do! Act! You did not go hard enough. Unless you reassess some of these goals here about how tough and hard we have to be right across the board, we're going to be bridesmaids. I can guarantee you that. They hate quick elusive forwards, but we've got good ones there. They hate a team with great accountability and ferocious attack on the footy and hunting around the contest. Sharks, they have to have forward momentum. Sharks die. They die if they get caught in a net because there's no water and oxygen running over their gills. So as soon as they stop, they die. What's that got to do with this? They're trying to come through us like a shark. Good luck to them. Good luck to them on grand final, big stage, lots of pressure. The best defensive pressure side of the competition they're coming up against. And they haven't got a win-loss ratio record against us that favours them over the last five times we've played them. And we have to kill this shark as early as we possibly can. Because if it just sits there, the shark, it's just going to die. It must reach a goal and transform anyone who tries to stop you. We've got seven, seven minutes to the warm up, warm up inside a day, video massage, home time. This is a magnificent sight, isn't it? Grand final day of the MCG. Blue sky, no clouds, sun out, 22 degrees. Can it get any better than that? It's not your man, it's our man. It's not individual goals, it's our goals. It's not from one of us chasing hard in all of us. And that has been the strength of that side for the whole year. Just from relentless sea footy. On this magnificent day, this last Saturday in September, with so much at stake between two great teams, both getting ready to come out. So this Hawthorne team ready to go. A brilliant day. They would uh, cherish that moment. 
So what destiny awaits this team that has swept all before them and given us so much pleasure in watching them play. A big wind was blowing. It's been called Geelong. And away we go, the grand final. Back to back for the Cats. But can the Hawks pull off an upset? It was 50 metres in the clear. Too much time to think. It's a mismatch. Stewart can't catch him. He immediately attracts a crowd. There he goes. That's my friends. It's 51 to 48. This is grand final footy. Geelong may be the team that's hanging on at the moment. Oh, Advantage! So it Geelong need a goal. They need a goal more than they have in the last two seasons right now. To that Joe once more. An unlikely bulky hero. He's in desperate trouble. He passes back. Williams goes in. Passes it through. The resistance may be broken. It will be survival of the fittest in the grand final. 14-5, Geelong 9-18.